briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1989 case Brown Machine, Division of John Brown Inc. v. Hercules Inc., the Missouri Court of Appeals dealt with the issue of conflicting terms in a contract for the sale of a T-100 trim press between Hercules Inc. and Brown Machine. Brown Machine had initially included an indemnity provision in their proposal, but Hercules objected to the term and sent a work order without it. Although Brown Machine received the work order, they failed to return a prepared acknowledgement. Things escalated when a Hercules employee was injured while using the trim press and filed a lawsuit. Brown Machine settled with the injured employee and then sued Hercules for indemnification, claiming the provision was part of their contract. The trial court ruled in favor of Brown Machine, but the decision was appealed, focusing on whether the indemnification provision was part of the contract. The Missouri Court of Appeals reversed the trial court's decision, finding that the indemnification provision was not part of the contract due to errors in the interpretation of UCC Section 2, 207. As a result, Brown Machine could not claim indemnification from Hercules for the settlement paid to the injured employee. This case highlights the importance of clear, explicit agreements in writing when dealing with conflicting terms and contracts. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.